Oh boy. Throat's a little verklempt today. Anyway, hi. It's Friday. Your Friday. My Friday. Everyone's Friday. Today we're doing a map suggested I should do called Finland. And right off the bat, I have this disclaimer that I'm probably going to do badly. Just because... Yes, I know Finland, but I'm not going to know exactly where. But that's what we're here to find out. How badly I'll do. Anyway, house cleaning to start out. Thank you all for the comments, questions, suggestions, and other information. It's been very helpful. If you ask me that one day, I would actually have a discussion on regional Finnish dialects between Finnish natives and the rest of the country, I would not even know where to start. It'd be weird enough that I would believe you, because why would you be that highly specific about something unless you were um, just being like completely truthful with me because it's so outlandish it had to be. Otherwise, why the hell would you bring it up? Um, but I love it. It was great. Interesting hearing these things. <clears throat> As I mentioned in one of the comments about, um, kind of upset, upset's probably too strong of a word, but just sad that all my history courses did not include all the cultures I'd find interesting. Because yes, how many times can you learn about Western European history before you're like, all right, we get it. I want to learn about the other countries, other regions, like, uh, ooh, this may actually help. Only if I know where these are, and I'm going to say I don't. Oh, wait. <laughs> it's right there. All right, now i got to find Ronla. Uh, zoom in a bit. See if I can't find it now. That was weird that that just popped up, but... Ronla. But as I was saying, I'd like to find Renua. That's almost it, but that's not it. 100 kilometers. I feel... Well, I have a minute 44, so I'm going to go a little farther out. Renua, I think that's actually it. It just got cut off. So I think we're like down here, I'm going to say. Is that 18 kilometers? Because that's going to be 100. <clears throat> I'm thinking. I think I got it. See how far out we are from Esmunti. Um... But there's regions of the world that I find interesting, and uh, the the I mean I called it side characters in the uh, in the comment that I put, but also it's kind of like um, the middle point between two opposite cultures. Um, you can kind of think of it like a swampland. I mean, cultural swampland has some derogatory terms to it, but I don't know what else to call it. It's it's a mixing pot. Uh, 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 blending of regions and cultures and whatnot, you know, not to diminish things like Finland or places like uh, Greece, Bulgaria, Macedonia, Albania, where Ottomans were a big deal for a very long time. And uh, they were here, so they did leave an imprint in the culture. So the what's there now still has hints, flavors, and influences from previous hundreds of years of um, Ottoman, I guess, occupation, you can call it. Oh, wait, wait, that's going to say where we are. Um, Asmunti, yeah, okay. So I, I think I got it out of just sheer dumbass luck. We were not that far from Asmunti. Actually, we kind of were, so maybe we're actually down here, I'm going to say. Oh, if I'd left alone, we would have gotten 5,000 points, but... <clears throat> I'm still going to take that as a a very big win. Thank you. Um, also, somebody mentioned a region of Finland being having their own like um, route, highway system or, or, or markings or whatnot. It started with an A. I don't know what part of the country it is, but if I had to guess, I'm going to say it's up here just because. That's just my assumption, but... We'll see. Um, but yeah, the Finn, you know, the Finn 
units were under Christ. Let's see if I can remember this. I'm going to get this wrong. So apologies for my inability to know these things. I'm just going to guess way back when the Dane, the Danish king, this is me going to be like, not drunk in history, but just like pull out of my ass history where I think I have an idea. But, um, K con Kentia. That like way back in the day, it was, uh, this was all, you know, Danish king. And then I want to say eventually the Norse came its own country. Everybody who lost that went to Iceland and blah, blah, blah. <laughs> At some point, Sweden kind of had all this. Um, I want to say somewhere in between there, Finns had their own independence and then Russia took it or Soviet Union took it. And at some point, God, I feel like I'm just showing how dumb I am. Or just like, I think all this stuff happened. But like, at some point, they. There was a war with the Soviets at some point. Because I remember there was always pictures of Finnish soldiers in their like winter outfits and skis and sniper rifle, just rifles, I believe. I mean, I know I'm just butchering this history. And then it kind of became their own thing. But, you know. Being that Russia was there for a while, Sweden was there for a while, they have got a bit of flair, flavor from uh, their occupiers, so to speak. I have no idea where this is. Um, this is definitely a dirt road, lots of trees. This isn't indicative of a region of Finland, if I had to guess, but we're near water. But, fuck, there's a lot of water here. You know, there's all that. This very well could be up here. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna like safe D and just guess like around here. Um, I'm just sure I'm gonna get a bad score. I mean, I don't see this dirt road going anywhere to a paved road. I'm gonna go back the other way because is this paved or is it just paved over a river? I don't know. I think it was just paved over the river, cause <clears throat> and my throat is just fighting me all today. But I, I really don't know if I got any thoughts or appreciations across and the babbling that I've been doing here. But uh, long story short, thank you all, and hope you keep watching. Keep those suggestions coming for maps. I'll show you how badly I don't know your the country suggested. Um, is there anything else I know about Finland? Um, there is the hydraulic press channel. There's I watched that for a while. I got ten seconds. I finally hit a paved road. All right. Hmm. Uh, yeah, it's just some guy in Finland who was relatively. Yeah, okay, we were farther south. I was never I was never gonna get that. You win Finland. That round. This looks eerily familiar. Uh yeah, it was just about this guy in his own little machine shop who uh Yeah, this is a dead end complete is this like ocean boats? I think. I love my characterization. Those look like ocean boats. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, what do we got? Don't go too far. That almost looks like the word we just had, but I know it's not. Yeah, he was the... the. That was the whole point of the channel, is they would just put a thing on it. What's it going to look like when it's crushed by hydraulic press? And it's just real satisfying things, watching things get smooshed. Um, anything else I know about Finland? Uh, there's a band that I've heard like one or two songs of that I kind of like. It comes through my Spotify weekly, which I'm going to give it props, at least for this week. It's given me some really good stuff I've never heard before. I'll get to that shortly, but the band I was thinking of is called Oot Po, uh, O-O-T, Pomo, or, or is it Ursus Fact? No, it's no, the song's Oot po Pomo or Pomo, and it's like Ursus Factory, I think is the name of the band. It's two, two guys. 
I don't know what the fuck they're saying, but their songs are catchy. Well, that one song is catchy as fuck. And then there was another one that I was listening to that I could not tell you what the fuck they were saying just because, okay, this may tell me something here. Erto Tava Rala La Laturi. I don't think I'm going to get as lucky again to see this here. That almost was that. Sementia Sets Sema. That's the extent of my, what I know about Finland, really. Um... Just that song. Well, two songs. I'm never going to see. I'm never going to find this thing. I feel that this thing is a small enough town that it's not going to show up this far out. But I'm giving it a shot. I'm just looking for really long words. And then I'll say, okay, I found a really long word. Does it start with an I? And I think... Um, no, that's a dumb sentence. We won't go with that. Anyway, yeah, Discover Weekly has given me some very good stuff this time. I mean, uh, there's this band called Brass Against that I kind of like. I mean, a lot of it has to do with the fact that Tool doesn't have anything on Spotify, which I'm a little bummed about. And I haven't listened to them in a long time. And then I just, these guys do covers of their stuff along with like, Bands like Raising Against the Machine, some other things. Sounds really good. And listening to them, like, man, I want to listen to some Tool, but I can't because they don't have anything on uh, Spotify. So you find substitutes, and these guys are pretty good substitutes. Granted, the guy that they have doing a couple of their songs is just off a little bit that, eh. I mean, he's a good singer. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll tell you that. It's just maybe not my cup of tea. But the lady who did, like, the cover of the pot. I kind of like the way her voice is. She does pretty good uh, rage covers, though. I will recommend them. And god damn it, where is this? I'm never going to find it. I'm going to say we're over here. And it's going to be bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, those weren't ocean boats, number one. And that's just fucking dumb luck. Can I see whatever the hell that thing's called? Iskin Kitty? No. I don't even know where it is on. I can't even, I don't even remember what it's called. My memory has just gone to shit to the point of concern how much I forget things. All right. Ooh, we finally have a road. All right. We got the 24. This is all, I'm going to say this is all I'm going to need to find out where we are. Now, was this, now I definitely see that there's different numberings. Like, I don't know these, like, major highways, and then these are, like, routes? I don't know, but this far out, I'm not getting, okay, 27. I had to zoom in a bit more. Um, is there numbering logic to these guys? It feel like there is, because the numbers seem to be going down. Oh, never mind. 22 to 28. 27. Okay, it's not these. We're on, like, this tier of road here. I think this should be helpful. Now it's just a matter of... I'm going to start down south and then just go around the border. I got 26. I'm going this way because I feel I'm going to get it going this way. 23. Oh, we're going to do this, aren't we? Where we're just off. By a number. Where are we? Come on. Show yourself. Don't do this to me. Come on. We're 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 like buds here. Why why you gotta do this to me? Come on. One of these? Nope. Hmm. Why does it do this? Why why do I have the luck of whenever these highway things show up, I can't actually ever 
find it. All right, we're going to go north. God damn it, this is... Okay, we got different... Is this the region he was talking about with the different numbering? Did I just happen to find the one example? Hmm. I got a minute left. I thought this was going to be all I needed. Turns out... Not to be the case. Wow. I can't find this. I am so mad. Why is this road eluding me? I found every other goddamn 20 number. Except this one. Come on, Finland. Come on, Finland. Wait, we like a little tiny island out here? No. I'm panicking. Something I thought was going to be easy is clearly not. We got, okay, we got numbers out here. That's neat. none of these. Oh, we got 25. Come on. I'm so mad. I got 30 seconds. Why? 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 All right. I'm putting us there. I'm, I'm a little frustrated. Oh, finally, 24. God, I hate everything. I hate everything. Did I mention how much I hate everything? Because I hate everything. I'm going to say... Like, I don't... Okay, so I just got dumbass luck with that. God. Did I go over that like 16 times and just not notice it? I mean, I don't know. This looks just like one, two, potentially three. But also, before I forget, um, because I have a wedding, I have to go over the weekend. Monday's video, I'm going to be recording right after this one. So if there's any other suggestions you make, just know that I won't be getting to them on Mondays. And I will be doing them the Wednesday afterwards. So if you have suggestions, just know that I will get to them just a day later than I normally do. Um, is there anything else I wanted to discuss? Oh, I did just finish my book for this month um, called Ancillary, Ancillary Justice. It's pretty good. I enjoyed it. Fast read. I mean, it was like 130-something pages, but I don't know. I found it a good pace. It wasn't, you know, a slog to get through. It was interesting. Well written. Apparently, it's won a bunch of accolades and awards. Uh, the Hugo Award or something like that. Uh, definitely good. I would recommend it. Um, next week, next month's book, I have an idea. This is, hmm. Why is the sign over here? Okay. Rukarananan Lamakla? Can I get over there? I cannot. Okay. I have no idea what that is. I've said it. I'll continue saying it. Um, I don't see any highway, like, root signs on this road. I am fighting off a sneeze. <coughs> Sorry, I couldn't hit pause in time. Ugh. Okay. Get me... something. I need, like, a reminder as to what road I'm on. But I'm not gonna get it. Okay, I got minute 40. I need, I need a sip while I do this. See if I can open up a bottle with one hand, drink it while still moving the mouse in search of any signage anywhere. So, pardon the next few seconds. Uh, excuse me. It's one thing that I, a lot of people have complaints about, especially when they listen to podcasts and things, is when people talk or drink on the mic when they're listening to them. Maybe this sign? Oh, a bunch of signs here. Kooks and Bob, no, no idea. This is 
saying the same thing, which is not helpful. Like, I need, I'm very, hmm. All right, so this is Mokon Rookie. Mokon, Raj, Jakar. You have Jakar here. Old well, Jakarta. Jakarta, no. I'm this, this, oh, that's not that. I, I, I feel that I'm just like, this is not the word of the town, and this is just like what that thing's called. And again, I'm very much stressed under. Okay, Mokan, I feel, is a thing. That's like, I think that's a town. This is not like the word for in. So, hmm. I don't know if I'm going to find this. Like, I'm kind of just relying again. Oh, fuck, I got no time left. Uh, We're here. We're there. Shit. I had no idea how much time we had. Oh, there, yeah, there's, that's Mo Moko. I had zero. I didn't see anything. Oh boy. Um, well, that one was pretty spot on. I'm pretty happy with that one. I think this one was frustrating. These, every, all the rest were just kind of fucking, just dumbass guesses. Um, yeah. I mean, I kind of had a feeling going into it, it was going to be a bit difficult, and here we are. <clears throat> but. That's why we play the game. Sometimes we nail it out of dumb luck. Sometimes we get close just for panic reasons. And sometimes we're blind as fuck. We can't see things staring at us this entire time. But whatever, week's done. Let me take a sip. I'd like to thank you all for watching and your continued support. Again, if you have any comments, questions, concerns, suggestions, complaints, ideas, suggestions of any kind, please leave them. In the comments below, I will look at them and get back to you when I can. Um, if it breaks out into more regional language dialect or whatever you want to call it, it'd be awesome. I mean, I'm not forcing you to do it. It was just fun to read that and just watch some sort of discussion spring out of it. Anyway, enjoy your weekend. We'll be back at it again on Monday. Thanks all for watching. We'll see you soon.